Experiential learning is a concept which I uh, took from the works of uh, John Dewey, Jean Piaget, and Carl Jung, and Kurt Lewin, and William James. And what experiential learning says is that the center of learning is experience, your own subjective experience. William James had this idea which he called radical empiricism. And what he was trying to do with this idea was he was trying to uh, integrate the two major streams in Western philosophy, the empirical stream and the rationalist stream. And what he said was, you know, as human beings, all we have is our experience. And all knowledge begins in our experience, and the way in which we know something is true is that it comes back and proves true in our experience. So experiential learning puts learning in the center of, a, of the learning process. As a learner, it's my experience that guides how I learn and, and says when I have learned something. And the exciting thing about this idea is that when ex your experience is the center of the learning process, you are in control of it. Uh, and you are able then to take initiative and create the kinds of experiences for yourself that you want and that lead to learning for you. The other people who are greatly influential in experiential learning also have made uh, great contributions to our understanding. Uh, John Dewey, for example. Most people know him as uh, the founder of progressive education, but they, what they don't realize is that his whole concept in, of learning, which he wrote about in a very famous book called Experience in Education, places the learner's experience at the center of the learning process. And he had a radical view of education, which was that it's not the teacher who is the center, but it's the learner who is at the center.